Hi there. In this video, we're going to show you how to turn the Karma email template into a editable MailChimp template. Um, so the first step is you want to locate the uh, files that you downloaded from ThemeForest. Um, and then you'll see the email templates folder. And uh, within this folder, there's all the various different color schemes. Um, and you can think of these as kind of just like a, a blank framework. Um, and then you just have to add your content uh, to, the, to one of these emails. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just pick a uh, color. So we'll choose coffee.html. So we're going to open that up. And uh, we're using Dreamweaver for our code editor. Um, you can feel free to use any, any other editor. Um, <clears throat> okay, so uh, if you scroll down a little bit, starting around line 57, you'll see this comment right here. It says content goes here. And that's where we're going to copy and paste all our different modules. Um, so we're just going to delete this. And we're going to go back to our folder. And you'll see uh, up towards the top, there's the MailChimp modules fold, uh, file. So we're just going to open that. And uh, <clears throat> this file is very similar to the other modules uh, file. The only difference is that this one can be edited through MailChimp. Um, so we just have to get our basic structure in place. And then we'll import it into MailChimp. And then that's where we can do all the text editing and image editing and things like that. Um, so starting around line 21, you'll see it says module start. Um, so everything under here is all the various uh, modules. So, uh, <clears throat> okay, so we'll just put in a few different random things. So we're just going to put in a full width image. So again, just copy the code. And within the content area, just paste the code. And let's see, put in some call out text. Um, and everything's commented out, so you'll see it says start module, call out text, end module, call out text. Um, so you just, you know, it's, it's very easy to, to follow. Um, so we're just going to paste this in there. And then we'll just go ahead and let's see. Maybe we'll put in these uh, three columns. So again, just copy the code and paste it within the content area. Okay, so now uh, now we're happy with the email and we want to import it into MailChimp. Um, <clears throat> so you're going to want to uh, ma log into your MailChimp account. You just visit the website and click uh, log in in the top right. And then just enter your account information. Um, and then we're going to click on My Templates. And Right over here on the left where it says import, we're going to choose import to my templates. And you just want to give your template a name. So whatever you want to name it, it's just for your reference. Um, and then you just want to browse for the HTML file that you just edited. So we'll click browse. And we're just going to locate that file. And ours was coffee.html. So we're going to hit open. And then we're going to upload. Okay, so now the uh, template is, is imported. Um, now if we go ahead and view this, we're just going to click on this little magnifying glass. You'll see we can preview our, our template. Um, <clears throat> so now we're just going to click edit. And uh, you'll see that it opens up in the uh, visual editor. Um, <clears throat> So, you know, very easily you can you can just kind of go in. You see as you hover over the items, uh, it comes up with a little edit button. Uh, so, for instance, the call out text, you know, if we just hover over and choose edit, um, this will allow us to easily use their, uh, their editor. So, we'll just kind of go ahead and paste in some new text just to show you. <clears throat> uh, same thing with this image right here. Um, if we want to... Uh, edit this image we can just again just hover over it um, you can upload a new image so you, you would just browse on your computer for the image that you want to insert um, <clears throat> and then just save and uh, that's about it I mean it's just it's just a matter of uh, you know it just works just like any other MailChimp uh, template so you just hover over each element and it gives you the edit option um, and then you just kinda drop in you know whatever content you want so same thing for this top header image you know, if you wanted to use the blank 
uh, image that we provide and just put your logo on top of it um, you can easily just do that you would just same thing you would just upload it um, from your computer and uh, you know that would do it for the template so when the templates all done um, you can just click save and exit and then when it comes time to uh, sending out a campaign um, you would click on campaigns and create campaign well, we'll just work out this this test one that we have already over here so we're just gonna click edit and uh, <clears throat> we'll go ahead and click on my templates over on the left and then we can choose the template that we just imported so we'll choose select and again you'll see that uh, we have our template here and we're just going to do save and exit and we're not going to go through the entire process of how to send a campaign but um, you know it's pretty it's self-explanatory you just kind of uh, insert the basic information it's about a five-step process um, and uh, that's about it so you, as you can see it's, it's very easy to import the template um, into MailChimp and uh, then you can make use of their uh, WYSIWYG editor um, so if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to get in touch with us on our support forums. It's uh, support.truthemes.net. All right, I hope this was helpful.